Hello, and welcome to Art Snacks. Our lesson today is going to deal with problem and solution. Okay, so we're going to first think of a problem. And so I'm thinking of a problem right now that might happen. Mrs. Let's see, Marley. Mrs. Marley got out of the car and went into the store to grab something really quick. But she locked her keys in the car. And inside the car was her cute little dog. He's a good dog. These guys pause up on the door. Hmm. Smell like a cat. Okay, our cute little cat. <laughs> That's problem solving. Okay, cute little cat is locked in the car. She, she doesn't know he's locked in there yet. She comes back with her groceries and goes, Oh no! My poor kitty's locked in the car. What am I going to do? Here's the car. You can see the wheels. Okay. And now we got a problem. She's got a problem. What can she do? He's in there. Let's call him Ned. Ned the cat. But used to be a dog and now is a cat. Okay. Ned's in there and she's like, Oh no, I don't have OnStar. What do I do? So she's really, really scared about that. But inside the car, Ned, not realizing it, there's a door handle. And the door handle has a switch on it. Ned puts his furry paw on the switch next to the door handle. Okay, here's the window. Here's the dash. Air conditioning vent. And outside, the worried face his mommy. His mouth is really big. Her hair is curly. And he pushes the little thing and this little thing pops up. We had a problem. Here was the problem. Poor Ned got locked in the car. The solution, accidental, but still worked. Ned's paw pushed down on the thing to open the door, and then his mom could get him out. That's our problem-solution lesson. See you next time.